Hey everyone, it's Rad, and I want to thank Keen for they are the sponsor of this video. And don't skip ahead, for I do have a special and exciting announcement to uh, make, including a very, very special gift for anyone who is watching, which I will get to it a uh, soon. For those who doesn't know Keen, this amazing website provides you with an access to a vetted psychics, spiritual advisors who can provide a guidance and insight in into life's challenges, into clarity in love, into relationships, and as well into career and, and many, many more. And Keen, it is a one of the most uh, affordable way to get an instant psychic reading with a professional at any time, 24 seven. What I love about Keen is that it is perfect for anyone who wants to talk with someone right away, anytime, anywhere there is no wait and it is excellent if you do have a burning question that literally needs an answer right now and it is double perfect for if you are on a budget too and here is where my gift for you guys is coming in for anybody who wants to talk with advisor on keen just click my link in the description down below and you get a 10 minutes for just only two dollars and just see for yourself for i do support keen and i have been around the block a lot when it comes to um psychics readers and especially prophets and i can tell you that there are those who are false but uh judging by the way keen found me i can tell you that they are venting their uh advisors uh, very carefully and you i do encourage you to try it out especially if you do have questions that i cannot answer like for example about health like for example about a reallocation because Saro is just not designed for that uh, for example as well yes or no questions as well guys it's only two dollars for 10 minutes and i cannot think of a better way to try it out and uh, get the clarity you seek so there are a uh, tarot readers, psychic readers, uh, love and relationship advisors, and as well spiritual advisors there. Uh, and you can take your time to make a selection of the reader of your choice, establish a bond, which is going to establish as well a goal, be it a uh, intention setting, be it a, a chakra clearing, be it healing, manifesting, and many, many more. And what is also amazing there is that Keen provides every customer of theirs with a monthly discount, which is a um, clearly a way to show you that they do appreciate you being there and it also provides you with a way to afford multiple readings should you need so the signing up process very simple i'm going to show you how all that you have to do is just watch my screen very few simple clicks for their website it is made intuitively and it's just you cannot get it wrong and just in these few simple clicks you are get yourself ready to make your selection of uh, readers and dive into your spiritual journey right away so to use my gift just click in the link in the description box and get your 10 minutes with a keen advisor of your choosing for just only two us dollars and and see for yourself how amazing they really are with the variety of their uh, advisors and as well the prices which have a ton of variety too should you be on a budget thank you keen for sponsoring this video Aries, Sun, Moon and Rising, welcome. And in this video, we're going to check on your week, which is February 28th up until uh, March 6th, 2022. And uh, your subscription as well as liking and commenting on, on any of my videos, guys, is going to be greatly appreciated, uh, which is going to help me push through the YouTube algorithm. And it is just a way how you can show me your support if you do think that I do deserve it. So with that said, let's uh, check on what uh, you are going to experience into this particular week with the first card of the Four of Pentacles. And uh, yeah, you can see the card very well. Uh, followed by the second one, which stands as the Star card. Then we do have the third one, which is the Page of Pentacles. Uh, moving next, uh, the fifth one, that is to be the Page of Swords. And the last one for you, Aries, that is going to be... Um, 
the uh, Empress. So few prospects it is what those cards here are showing, especially having uh, these two cards aligning, uh, these two cards aligning, I'm sorry, followed by uh, the uh, or uh, being following the star card itself, the star card uh, itself and that pretty much to me at least speaks that there is a very very huge chance for you to make made up or make up or whatever you call it well, well, well basically to transcend a friendship into a fruit, fully productive and fruitful relationships but at the very least there is definitely there an individual stepping in for you into that particular week showing you not just only appreciation but as well devotion and in generally that interaction is gonna scream to you i do worth it okay it's just i do worth it but that is not gonna happen before the four of pentacles for you kind of takes place at the very start of the week and that card literally shows that at the start of the week you are going to be on fire everywhere everything and everywhere you go everything you do i'm sorry about my rumbling here it's just it's a bit exciting but with the four of pentacles guys at the very start of your week well week you are going to find yourself uh being at a place where you had ensured your certain and secure future in everything you do, whether it is love, whether it is career, whether it is some kind of a friendship, relationship, and in just in everything you touch there, you will be able to ensure its future. So I do advise you here, Aries, to have the most pure intentions toward yourself and toward, toward the things you do at the very start of the reading, because alas, Whatever your intentions are, they are going to work out. So malicious intentions, they lead to a kind of like a future with malice, isn't it? So having a good intentions, like love, like prosperity, well, that is what your future is going to look like. Especially having the next card here, which is the star card showing prosperity in every single front that you go. The star card, the very minimum, all right? This is a, the very minimum about the card. It is that your at least immediate future is going to completely revolve around your ideals and your standards, you seeing them completely fulfilled. Your job is likely to go along the way you expect, and not just only the way you expect, but the way you hope that is going to go forward your friendships your relationships as well now as we are talking about relationships by the way the star card stands for a unfolding love and that's why i do think that's uh, i'm sorry that's the um empress i do think that with the page of pentacles here that is where a friendship really has an opportunity that is if you do want to take it though is going to transcend into being just more than a friendship and i do want to draw one additional card to the page but as soon as it times uh, as soon as it time comes about so with the star card like I said, at the very least, your ideals is going to see merit and your standards are going to see a way to be fulfilled. And another thing that I love about the Star Card, guys, it is that it is a, a sign that the, the, the tumultuous experiences, the turmoil, the struggle, uh, it's literally over here at the very first and initial stage of your week. And you do get to enjoy clear air. You do get to enjoy prospect you do get to enjoy uh, and i struggle putting it into words but think of it that you are to see your goal in a way that you can predict every single um aspect that can come in the future therefore uh preparing yourself being forewarned and therefore being forearmed but don't forget that here there is a, a huge huge chance that, that card stands for unfolding love and as such it develops slowly but a certainly and as i promised i do want to draw one additional card to the page of a pentacles and the card is going to be the seven of swords selfless individual that is just somebody who is is ready to sacrifice their well-being for others in this particular case for you that is, for example, the person who is ready to quit the job so they can be with you or, uh, you know, to sacrifice a good opportunity. So to give you a good opportunity, that is a person who values your well-being 
more than their well-being okay and, and i do believe that that is a friend that you do have around and should that and that friend has obviously more than just a, a friendship towards you so i do suggest you guys to look around for that person and if it is somebody that kind of like pulls you in if it is somebody that kind of like a uh, uh, you show interest toward them even the slightest that is give the man or the woman a chance they do deserve it for you will find no more loyal a companion than they are whether it is in love affairs or it is in uh, a relationship yeah friendship affairs as well and together as per stand with the page of swords that we do have together you're going to do quite of a i would say unthinkable but not in a bad way all right so unthinkable things and you are going to come up to some very unique ideas that you want to dive into and that you do want to explore not to mention that with the page of swords that card speaks that you're going to learn from one another a great deal and the bummer here is going to be that you have not expected it okay but that person holds a key to a big concern of yours as you do hold the key to big concern of theirs this is a a mutual help that you are going to find into one another into this upcoming week and the more you grow together the more you are to see that it will the, the life is going to be much difficult if you don't have each other a uh, by your side to a point where by the end of the week as we do have the empress here guys by the end of the week you both together are gonna grow i believe inseparable that card here shows the comfort that you are gonna experience being with one another whether it is that you do kill time whether it is that you do something very important something very substantial for your life for their life whether it is that you do talk for example whether it is that you do discuss plans for the future because that card by the way the empress carries on a huge influence when you do come to uh, discuss a plans for the future how you both stand with one another do you have any chances being together do you have any chances being happy live ever uh, living ever after or regardless of how you say it in english okay but here at the end of the week i do believe that what you are to do is to restrict your uh, focus to this person page of pentacles so you can determine and not just only determine but as well see for yourself how far you both can go the uh, empress does not guarantee you uh how can i put it into words success like definitely you have it in the back the empress guarantees you that you are to see the situation for what the situation truly is and you will be able to make your uh, decision which is going to be well found and very mature so whether you decide to go along with this relationship or not whether it is a business relationship or a, a romantic relationship is going to be the right choice out there and your and the fruits of that choice uh, you will they are not going to be bitter so I, I was about to say that you're going to enjoy them but they are not going to be a bit of fruits and you very well will have a certain plan for how to address similar situations in the future so that was your reading hopefully you do enjoy it aries and you are to see each, uh, we are to see each other a uh, next time until then bye